step three in building our brand. So we are going to talk about your Facebook and Instagram profiles, whatever social media platform you are choosing to use for your business. So you just came up with your top three to five things. Now we want to get those out there. When someone goes to your profile, they should be able to tell with instantly. They should get a sense of like who you are, what you're all about. Um, so what what we need is we need a nice looking bio that's concise and it's easy to, to read. Um, and it's not about your company. It's about you. You are your company, right? You are you. You're a human being. What are your things? Let's talk, put those in there so people can relate to you. Again, people buy from people they relate to, people who seem like people, not people who seem like they are used car salesmen. No offense to used car salesmen, but you guys know what I mean. So my first tip is to go into your notes app on your phone and you're gonna write your bio in there. Now by writing it out, I mean like snippets, like phrases, one word, or a phrase and you're gonna stack them and you're gonna space them. So if there's white space, it's easy to read. And then you're gonna use some fun emojis. One of my things for right now is keto. Um, and it's off and on been something that's been part of my bio, been part of my things. 2020, it wasn't one of my things. It wasn't something that I focused on. And so I took it off of my bio, but it's something that I'm back to focusing on and so that is something that I'm putting in there. Um, I want people to, to associate me with keto. So I am putting keto and I'm using some fun emojis like an avocado or a coconut or coffee because I love my, my morning keto coffee. But your things are going to evolve. That's just human nature. So I you know I encourage you to like every few months go and check your bio. Um, is there a new hobby that you've discovered? Put that in, make that one of your things. You know, when summer comes, I'm going to put, you know, you can find me on my patio in my happy place. I'm not putting that right now because it doesn't apply right now. It's not one of my things. So once you've done that, I, oh, first off, go look at my profile. Feel free to check out my my Facebook or my Instagram just so you can kind of get an idea of what I'm what I'm what I mean by stacking and how you want that look and feel. And if you need help with that, just message me. But comment on this post once you are done or on this video once you're done.